Well, there are plenty looking forward to seeing this. A capacity crowd here. Well, get ready for some high-grade football, Peter. Two strong teams, as you say, full of wonderful individual talent. And we have every right to anticipate some really entertaining football. As to whether we'll see a high-scoring contest, that's a little harder to predict. I'm not complaining, though, because there are good players everywhere you look around this surface, and that's a fine start in itself. So that's got things on the way. Jim, which player is best equipped for this game? Yeah, Christian Eriksen. He's super accurate with both feet, Peter, and able to deliver a cross or a through ball with just the perfect bend or indeed weight. All this allied to great awareness and vision, which make him a massive creative talent. What I really like about Eriksen, though, is that he's got the energy and the determination to keep going for 90 minutes every game. He's a trier. Yes, getting the best out of him will count for so much. And they've got it back as soon as they gave it away. Vass. Eriksson. Oh, that's nice. Vass. Vass proving impossible to wrestle off the ball. Ball's out on the left now. Gets away from his opponent. It's a loose ball. Well, the crowd clearly liked what they just saw. Some real no-nonsense defending. Jag goes looking. Eriksson. Oh, well intercepted. Really alert to the danger. There's a long ball. Looking for space out wide. Ball's loose, who's getting there? Good challenge, goes for goal! No, he's not played the ball, that's a foul. Keeper sends it forward. Just brushed off the ball there. And he's certainly caught him there, it's a free kick. There could be trouble here. But for now, the referee is keeping his cards in his pocket. No messing about, just bludgeoned away. Gets wrestled off the ball. Well, they are working very hard to get it wide now, Jim. Yeah, I think they've decided to concentrate on, on working the flanks to help the production line. It's, uh, it's where the room is. Oh, he's going to be pulled back for that one. Bass. Hoists it forward. Done very well to intervene. The other side yet able to force a breakthrough here. And he's on his way! Questions were asked, but he's given the answers. 
great strength, too strong for his opponent. Oh, that's a waste. Hernandez. Across the field it goes. And it's Greek. Griezmann! And he's there to make a great save. Well, as Tesco beat the keeper has just received an A plus grade. And it's played forward. Vass gets his foot in there. Gets! They've done it! Oh, offside. Yeah, the referee hadn't spotted his assistant's raised flag. He has now, so he's ruled the goal out for offside. The moment's uncertainty there, but it is the right call. Kasper Schmeichel sends that a long way. Out to the right. Oh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. Oh, it's Dempel. He's had a shot! A chance to play it in. Mbappe hits one! Superb goal! Well, let me assure you that scoring just before half-time is always a real treat. And when it's one of your top talents who delivers it, it just seems to fuel confidence that little bit more. That was glorious. Pinpoint accuracy. You know, I'm not going to be hard on the goalkeeper because that moved all over the place on its journey. France break the deadlock and that ought to be the trigger for a really exciting and entertaining game from here on Griezmann it's Griezmann <laughs> not much subtlety he's launched himself there lovely bit of skill Been leave it clear. Oh, shooting chance! Away from immediate danger. Oh, and with that, the half time whistle goes. There we are, off they go for half time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half, but there has only been that one goal. It is very, very tight. Reflections on the first half. France merit their advantage on, on the balance of play. They did most of the probing and got their reward, although they should have a bigger lead. Could come back to haunt them. France head into the dressing room, pleased with the thought that they have that all-important lead. Analysis to come during the break. We're promptly into the second 45 minutes. France carrying a one-goal lead. Havar. That was good pressing, forced the error to put an end to it before things could get even more threatening. That's a throw. Delaney. Eriksson tries to get it forward quickly. Has he found his man? Too much on it, and that's the keepers. 
France clearly aren't looking comfortable on the ball at the moment. Predictability has just crept into their play. Griezmann goes through the middle. Dembele. Oh, the ball's come loose. A reprieve, albeit perhaps momentary. Havar. Mbappe. Mbappe! And he nearly went all the way. Mbappe can really show some outlandish skills, which is always welcome and obviously refreshing. Forward it goes. Plays it out to the flank. Denmark showing a little more urgency now, and to be honest, Peter, this is what's required. Well, this isn't the time to talk about risks now, Jim, is it? They just have to hurl everything at it and hope for a break. Just has to be done. Kia. Good work on the right flank. Now, what's next? Finds himself eased off the ball. That's the sort of defending that is going to upset the opposition. It already has, actually. Well, they know he's the root of potential problems, Peter, and they seem intent on uprooting that problem like that. Well, that wasn't too dissimilar to the previous attempt. They're just lacking a cutting edge, Peter. And while that's fairly obvious, the rest of their attacking play is actually quite good. They've played it short. Got the ball glued to his feet. It's a very good battle there. Terrific to watch. Defending was strong and firm. Next Dembele. Oh, good take in a good area. Mbappe. And that has been cleared. Turns it out wide. France got their goal at the end of the first half. And the score is 1 0. Ericsson. And that's put paid to a promising move. been intercepted and that will come to nothing it's one oh so close France need to hold on for a few more moments Vass. Oh, that's neat. And it's played forward. Denmark have it back and they can go again. Christensen. Mbappe. Can he get through? So that's it. It is all over. France win it by the only goal. Result, no question, the most important thing, however it came. Final score, 1-0. How would you sum up what we've witnessed, Jim? Well, to me, this is a result, Peter, that says an awful lot more than the scoreline suggests. You know, after the goal, the team just settled down and, and looked...